Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the most amazing footage of wildlife from around the world. In today's video, we're going to take a look at an elephant getting drunk on fermented fruit. But before we start, don't forget to hit that like button if you love nature and wildlife videos. Also, stick around until the end because we have a special announcement to make. Now let's begin. Have you ever heard of elephants getting drunk? In Africa, there's a legendary fruit that supposedly turns elephants into the ultimate party animals. It all starts with the humble marula fruit. These small, round fruits grow on trees across the African savanna. And when they ripen and fall to the ground, something magical happens. Or maybe it's just science. But either way, it's pretty fun to watch. As the marula fruits ferment under the hot African sun, they begin to produce natural alcohol. And when elephants come along and eat large amounts of these fermented fruits, people believe they can become tipsy. Oh no, stumbling around like they've had one too many drinks. Elephants belching out giant burps and even falling over on their tusks. So how much fermented marula fruit does it take to turn an elephant into a full-blown party animal? According to National Geographic, elephants must consume about 88 pounds of marula fruit to get drunk. That's the equivalent of more than 66 pounds of beer. But other sources say that it takes up to 132 pounds of fermented fruit to get an elephant drunk. While some scientists argue that it would be extremely unlikely for elephants to accidentally consume that much alcohol, others say that the elephants must stumble around in a drunken stupor after eating only a few fruits. They claim that a single elephant can quickly gobble up a bunch of fermented marula fruit, enough to get them drunk in no time. And while we may never know exactly how much fermented marula fruit it takes to turn an elephant into a full-blown party animal, one thing is for sure, these videos of drunk elephants are always a good time. Before we continue with the video, here's a little quiz for you. Do you think elephants get drunk on marula fruit? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Now let S take a closer look at some of the videos that have been captured of these so-called drunk elephants. In this first video, we see a herd of elephants walking through the jungle. One of the elephants seems to be staggering and falls to the ground. The other elephants in the herd try to help him up, but he just doesn't seem to want to get up. It looks like this elephant had one too many drinks. But is he really drunk? Or is there another explanation for his strange behavior? Some experts suggest that elephants might roll around in the dirt for a variety of reasons, such as to relieve itchy skin, mark their territory, or regulate their body temperature. Others believe that it's simply because they feel like having a good time. After all, elephants are known for being playful creatures and they often engage in mock charges and trumpet loudly just for fun. In this next video, we see a group of elephants playing near a river. One of the elephants is seen picking up a log and swinging it around. He then throws the log down and lets out a loud trumpet. The other elephants in the group seem to be encouraging his behavior and they also trumpet loudly. While it's tempting to assume that these elephants are drunk and playing, there is another explanation for their behavior. Elephants are known to use logs and other objects as tools to play and explore their environment. They've even been observed using sticks to scratch themselves and sweep away debris. So it's possible that the elephants in this video are simply using the log as a toy and not because they re-drunk. These next videos show a drunk elephant drinking water from a puddle. It looks like he's really enjoying himself and doesn't care who sees him. In fact, he seems to be trying to show off his drinking skills. However, there is another explanation for this elephant's behavior. Elephants are known to be very social creatures, and they often engage in all kinds of activities with their herd mates. They play together, groom each other, and even go through mud puddles together. So it's possible that this elephant is simply playing with his friends and not because he's drunk. What about this elephant? This poor guy looks like he's completely drunk. He's stumbling around and doesn't seem to know where he is. He even falls over on his tusks and rolls around in the dirt. It's hard to imagine that this elephant isn't drunk, but again, there is another explanation for his behavior. Elephants are known to be very curious creatures, and they often investigate anything new in their environment. They use their trunks to sniff and explore their surroundings and their tusks to dig and push things around. So it's possible that this elephant is simply investigating the puddle and his behavior doesn't have anything to do with alcohol. What about this elephant? He looks like he's completely drunk. He's stumbling around and doesn't seem to know where he is. He even falls over on his tusks and rolls around in the dirt. Again, it's hard to imagine that this elephant isn't drunk, 
but there is another explanation for his behavior. Elephants are known to be very excitable creatures, and they often get very excited when they replaying, or when they re-around humans, they might start trumpeting loudly, waving their tusks, and running around in circles. So it's possible that this elephant is simply excited about something and his behavior does not have anything to do with alcohol. So what do you think? Are these elephants really drunk on marula fruit? Or is there another explanation for their behavior? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. But if you ask me, I think it's pretty clear that these elephants are drunk. I mean, what else would explain this behavior? Elephants don't normally stumble around, fall over, and drink from puddles. So it's clear that they are redoing something they normally would in-do if they were in-drunk. Besides, it's not like there's any scientific evidence to suggest that elephants don't get drunk. In fact, scientists believe that elephants can become intoxicated by eating fermented fruit. So it's entirely possible that these elephants are drunk on marula fruit. Ultimately though, we may never know for sure why these elephants are behaving the way they are. But that does unstop us from having fun and imagining what it would be like if elephants got drunk on marula fruit. And while we may never know for sure if elephants get drunk on marula fruit, one thing is certain, the idea makes for a fun and entertaining legend. The story of the drunk elephants has become one of the most popular and enduring tales in the animal kingdom, and it's sure to continue entertaining people for years to come. So what do you think? Are these elephants really drunk, or are we just imagining it? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to Natural Network for more wild and wonderful animal stories. We hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as we enjoyed making it for you. Thank you for your support, and we'll see you next time. Here's another video you might enjoy watching.